Hello everyone, this is Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. Today I'll have another episode of 2022 Pocket Planner video and I'll talk about a no-name pocket planner which I found on Amazon. So I was looking for the cheapest uh, possible uh, pocket planner you can buy on Amazon and then I came across this. So this is a no-name brand, I never heard of this, it's called uh, E-Team Can and it's just only $10. Uh, for example, if I show you on Amazon right here, you can see that this is only $10, 4 by uh, 4.2 inch by 3 inch, which you can see right here, that it's really small. And some of the features, according to the manufacturer, is that the paper is of a very high quality dowling paper, which is smooth and not easy to penetrate. And then uh, the planner is excellent planning for functionality and portability, uh, which I can see that, you know, this is a very so small that you could easily put it in your pocket. And then uh, the surface of the black fabric weekly planner is decorated with gold 2020 planner font. So this is supposed to be fabric uh, cover, but you know, we're going to take a look at it right now and you're going to see so I just did a uh, Moleskine uh, 2022 planner review about two three weeks ago and I was just looking to see that you know what you can buy uh, for the cheapest price on Amazon or anywhere else you know if there's a planner available at very low cost and this is the only one I can find which is $10 uh, I haven't come across anything below $10 so if you have anything you can just you know mention in the comment section so let's take a look and we're going to see if really this is okay or this is just a junk you know in the planner and waste of money so you can see that you know they have actually no name no nothing it just says like you know keep away from the children made in China but on Amazon I saw the name e team can and here even they didn't point, uh, mention the e team can or anything it just has 2022 planner small uh, appointment book made in China so let's uh, open it up and we're going to see how it looks okay so just to set the wrapper and the first thing I feel that this is really light, you know, you have like, you know, I, I, I don't have any feeling that I'm holding anything. It feels like I have a feather in my hand. So it's very lightweight. And the cover, as they mentioned uh, on Amazon, it's made of fabric. It feels like there's some sort of fabric in, uh, but it's not like, you know, very bad quality. That's surprising. And it's not very high quality either. It sits somewhere in the middle, but you know, that should be uh, good enough for a $10 planner and on the back uh, there is no nothing so let's open this up so this is the first page uh, personal memoranda and it has some information you can fill up for example it's kind of very hard to see but i can see name uh, looks like passport number renewal date and all sort of information and if we just you know keep moving on then they provided a 2022 calendar and then uh, there's also a 2023 calendar, which I have it right here. And then uh, let me just bring a little closer. And then we have a standard world uh, time zones. And then we have even here country and city actually, what time it is. So that's not bad either. And then we have world holidays and more information but actually i can't even read what what's in here because it's so tiny uh i'm having difficulty to read uh and let's just flip this here and same it continues world information and then we have metric for everyday uses so this can be let me just take a look here uh i think these are like in a conversion charts but unfortunately i cannot really read from uh, where i'm Am I standing and even if I bring too close to my eyes I cannot really see so I don't know uh, I don't see any point of like you know providing uh, this information and then here you have uh, clothing size and then here you have calorie and cholesterol counter so it looks like they provided a good amount of information but uh, I think this is useless uh, because you know it's really hard to see so now here we start the week one uh, and looks like for every day you have a section and each page has 
uh, on left and right sides that you know uh, four seven days and then here a little bit extra space to write something more and looks like that's that's what continues throughout the planner so let me just you know keep moving to a new month for example so if we go to February then you can see that you know same thing continues and then there's this little blank space to write something and let me just like you know flip it through quickly okay so here this is the last page of the planner and this is where actually it kind of shows that you know this is very cheap uh, because you know here they should have provided something like you know more a better quality of like you know end page or a board but this looks very cheap and there's a good chance looks like it's gonna come off uh, because if you see take a look at it here I'm not sure how long it's gonna be able to hold and if you look at on the very front page it looks like the same issue it's like you know it looks like you know very uh, cheap but overall quality actually is not too bad you know I didn't expect to get what it's providing for ten dollars so what I'm going to do let me just like you know, quickly mark something with my uh, roller ball pen and see if there's any ink bleeding so I'm just going to you know uh, put here something like this and let's wait a few seconds to dry this and I think this should be okay and if you take a look at on the other side uh, it didn't actually bleed it has like you know the pressure mark but I don't see it's bleeding so paper quality is not too bad okay let me just go back the page before again and looks like yeah it absorbed properly and there's no bleeding on the other side of the page so this is so small that this is going to you know come in very handy if you want to keep something with you all the time and another thing I can see that uh, there's no like you know a uh, whole month at a time I I like when there's like you know let's say January on the full side box by box or February to have a you know at a glance a look at the month uh, that's what it's missing but again this is just you know ten dollars uh, you're not gonna expect everything from this so what I was referring to is something like this but every month in the beginning of every month so let's let's say for example here you have the January box and I was expecting something like here or fold both two pages for the January so you can you know add a glance look just before you start in the month of January uh, usually other notebooks have that and another thing I know see if it lies flat on a surface so it doesn't look like it is so it's kind of like you know not holding uh, on a surface so if you want to just write then you have to just kind of hold on to it then write so it doesn't lie flat on its own so I don't think yeah it's kind of like you know trying to close itself so that's what it looks like so overall I'm not actually too disappointed about the quality and the usefulness of this cheap planner uh, definitely you're not going to get something like you know uh, 20 or 30 dollars moleskin or other brands but it does its job and this is just like you know uh, you can just take it with you anywhere you go and it can work as a handy travel friendly planner uh, for 2022 on this channel all my reviews are non-affiliated unbiased and honest there are no affiliated links uh, no nothing so that way you get only totally uh, honest and unbiased opinion so if you are interested in this plan you have to just like you know search on your own and you can find it on Amazon probably from other manufacturers or other uh, distributors but yeah this is definitely not as bad as I was expecting and you know I can say that this, this is just good enough for $10 which is the cheapest planner I can find on Amazon. 
So that's all for today. Thank you for watching this video. There will be more videos coming up, so I'll see you shortly. Thank you.